Alright guys, welcome back to Resident Evil 7. I'm at a pretty sticky crossroads here. I gotta cure either my wife Mia, or the stranger that helped me through the whole game, Zoe. She attacked me. She hasn't attacked me at all. But that's my wife. So I don't know. I really don't know. But I have a feeling curing Mia is probably gonna be my best option. And give me like the most favorable ending to the game. I'm not sure. I have to do it. Alright, Mia. I'm sorry, Zoe! It's fine. It was foolish thinking I could escape. But Zoe. Go! Both of you just go! Come with us. I'm I'm sure there's someone who can help. This is not home. Apparently I'm alone, Mia. Oh, oh Zoe, I'm so sorry. I'm s I'm sorry. Don't bother. There won't be anyone left to help. Oh my God. I killed her whole family. <laughs> so that's the Gill game. Zoe. I'm actually like choked up about that. I got my wife back though. We're, we, you know, I, I did what I set out to do when I came here to find her. Oh, God, poor Zoe. Ethan? Thank you. Who the hell else was I gonna choose? Ethan. Mia, I know you've been through a lot. We need to talk. You had something to do with all this, didn't you? Look, I just want to know the truth. Me too. Me Ethan, too. I honestly don't remember. Try. <laughs> what the f What the hell is that? How the fuck did that get here? Is that a fucking ship? Holy crap. That thing is gigantic. And why is it in the swamp? You're okay. What the hell was that? Um Legit, yeah, what the fuck is that? Holy shit, I thought the game was over. <laughs> I guess we get more. Hey, I, I don't have a problem with that. This way. Uh, um. Oh god, now I'm Mia? Fucking Mia. How? This game is got the switch up, man. Better start running. Escape the Baker home. Sick. Do I have any weapons or anything? Oh, great. I have nothing. Strange bottle that you found in your pocket after waking up. It's probably important. Alright. Alrighty then. Where the fuck's Ethan? Oh, Mia could move a lot quicker than Ethan could. Oh, there he is. There I am. There I am. E hey, my myself. Wait. Ethan? What the fuck? Ethan. Ethan's blonde. Ethan! Ethan! Uh Amazing. Just amazing. But yeah, what the hell, Ethan? I don't know, I like... I've tried to look in the mirror while I've played the game to see what I look like. Because I was curious, but... I don't know, I, I never expected myself to be blonde. That... that's pretty cool. 
But it just doesn't match what I pictured in my head, you know? Oh, it's probably a store here. Wow. This is fucking creepy. So now I'm in the ship. And again, why the hell is there a giant freighter ship in a swamp? Oh wait, you know what? You know what? When you first start playing the game and you're in the Baker house, they do talk about a, uh, a storm and they're preparing for a giant like hurricane. So it's possible the ship crashed here or like got washed up during that hurricane. But I don't know why the complete change of, you know, scenery now. Oh. oh, that made me jump. That made me fucking jump. What was that? I mean, these graphics are incredible. Absolutely incredible. I wish I had a weapon. I don't like the fact that I don't have a weapon. Whoa! <laughs> Holy mother of God! It's like a statue of melted oil people. Are they gonna grab me while I walk by? Oh my God, I don't like this. Huh. All right, very anticlimactic, dick. looking for where am I going what am I doing there's nothing there oh. they're dead. They're all dead. god what is it the engine room what the fuck are you talking about she killed them all fuck what the hell is going on we need some weapons is there any weapons on this ship I, I don't know but Let's go this way. Maybe we can get out of here. Okay, I saw where they're going. I just wanted to see if this door opens, but okay, nope. Oh, hard hat. So he's asking for weapons too. I was just saying that. That I need a weapon. I need a gun. I really do need protection. And obviously there's activity on this goddamn ship. Do I go down or do I keep going forward? Oh, I guess there's no choice. Is this open? No, dead end. It's kind of eerie, actually, how quiet it is on this fucking ship. Like, you can't hear anything. She's not my child. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Whoa! Hello! He must have been hiding from something. <laughs> Crew. Captain Ed Charlie, Chief Physician, Communication. Okay.
There's another dead guy. I can't imagine what happened on this ship. But that little girl I've been seeing, um... She's inside me. She's inside everyone. That little girl they've been... I've seen and they've talked about, Evelyn. Um... I have a feeling she had something to do with this. I mean, she had to, if, you know, for the storyline to make sense. My god, where the f where am I going? Seriously, wh where am I going? I am all turned around. Well, well, well. Quite the damn view, huh? It's like the ship is ripped literally in half. Or wait, am I not even on? Wait, I am on the ship. Then what? what is that over there? Alright, I don't know. LNG tanker Annabelle. Built 1987. I probably don't need to know any of that. Is there one person alive on here? Did anyone- OH SHIT! Oh! Oh! Oh my god. What? What are you? Ew, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. I do not like that at all. But, I'm gonna keep going that way anyway. What the shit? Am I remembering what? That door closes behind me, I swear to god. Oh! Fucking, I knew it. I fucking knew it. I'm trapped. Oh wait, here's a ladder. Dude, looks like you had a bad day. Am I supposed to go through here? I guess I jumped down here. Oh god, Evelyn, go away. What do you want? What are you talking about? You said Evelyn, Wait. come here. Oh shit. I think we got a zombie over there. Fuck. I gotta hide. It's a box. Uh, see, I can't even break a box open. Okay, cool. An herb. It's like I'm starting the game all over again. I worked so hard to get all those weapons, and now it was for nothing. So now I gotta do it all over again from the beginning, basically. You know, like a whole new storyline. Sounds like it's right here. I don't know, I gotta find a weapon, like, badly. There's gotta be something around here. Chem fluid. So, okay, cool. I can make a health. We're making progress. The fuck was that? Oh Jesus Christ, dude! I, I don't even have fists. I can't even fight you. It's locked. 
shit. There's another one. Dude, they're like everywhere. I have no defense. Fuse. Okay. Oh shit! Ow, 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 ow! No, 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 no. Dude, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do here. Oh, they're fucking everywhere. Can I get in here? Can oh, maybe I can use that fuse. Let me in, let me in, let me in! Close! That's freaking scary. One F. Security, sick bay, control room. There's two of them. Here comes another one that way. I kind of want to get around and like see what the hell is back here. Oh shit. It's like every time you try though, I think they know. Yeah, they're just stalking around. Alright, let me try something. I wanna get back in this room again. God damn it! Oh god damn it! Close, 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 close! <laughs> He's trying to get in. Dear Jeanette, how- hey. <laughs> I can't believe I got zombies outside, I'm just reading this note. Hey, how's it going? I guess half a year or so will have passed by the time you get this letter. Life is so boring here. Day after day, just the same old sea. Although there is one thing that's different. This time, we have some passengers sailing with us, which hardly ever happens. It's a couple with a little girl. I think they're distant relatives of the captain. Imagine traveling on a tanker instead of a passenger ship. They must be hard up. I tried talking to the little girl earlier, and her dad shot me this nasty look. What's he so worried about? Now that I think about it, the captain said he didn't even have any relatives. Maybe I'm overthinking. I miss you. Love, Jim. Okay, so Evelyn, that little girl, was traveling on the ship with a man and a woman. So we're, we're piecing together the story here a little bit. And it appears something happened, because that girl's a fucking, like, supernatural freak. Oh, why can't I open anything? It's too late for us, but at least I can let the world know what happened here. I was on the night shift, so I was taking a nap in the bunk room around noon. I was half asleep and I heard a kid, a little girl, laughing, or was it in my head? I woke up at 19.30. There was some sort of ruckus in the passageway. Drew, one of the engineers, came in and said that there was something going on down below. Maybe a... Oh, son of a bitch with my controller. He looked pale in the face. He told me he was going to check it out, but he never came back. It must have been around 1950 when I heard the scream. I went to the laundry room to check and saw Clark being eaten by some sort of monster. The, the monster turned and started coming towards me, huge shark-like teeth snapping at Shaw. I screamed like a little girl and it ran for it. Now I'm huddled up in the bunk room shaking as I write this. There's a whole host of these creatures lurking in the passageways now. I can still hear the screams now and then, but there's no way I'm going out there. And that's it. I've written everything I know. Okay, so the ship was overtaken by the zombies. That much is clear. Hell yeah! I need these for sure. Now where am I? No, close! <laughs> oh! Hell yeah! Exactly what I needed. Pistol. I can actually take these motherfuckers down. I guess I'll save here really quickly. 
I'm not going to overwrite that, actually. So that way I can go back and um, maybe I'll cure Zoe and see what happens if I do that. I'll play the game out the way I did, and then I'll probably go back and do it with the uh, alternate ending. I managed to get a gun. It's really all that matters right now. It's locked. Second floor. I'm making my way up. Oh shit, why did that one open? Well, you know what? Let me check it out. Because I have no idea there could be something really important in here. I didn't like that sound. Whatsoever. Oh fuck, it's fucking Evelyn. Jesus Christ. Hey! Oh god, I don't what? like- What? Why? Oh my god. You need to remember, so we can be a family. What does she think, like, I'm her mother? I'm not your mother, little girl. Alright. Oh god, that's fucking creepy. I wonder if I do it here. If she'll be looking at me. Oh no. She looks like the- Ew! Look at the way she follows you! Oh my god, okay. Alright, Evelyn. You win. You fucking win. I'll watch your videotape. <laughs>